This is a drum cover rehearsal for Black Sabbath's NIB, Nib, which I did look up. They say one of the guys had a, a nib of a beard. I think that's where they think this came from. So I'm going to do a drum cover. This is drumless. I'm taking a drumless track. Hello. Oh, I have the reverb cranked because the drums, the, the, this recording, this Black Sabbath recording is so beefy. It wasn't really just Zeppelin that got a really beefy sound in those days, like 67, 70, 71, just that Zeppelin really sort of took it and went with it. But like Cream at Royal Albert Hall, or Zeppelin at Royal Albert Hall, January 9, 1970, Listen to the, in another window, just open up Nib, N-I-B, with the drums and everything. And just listen to that recording. It almost sounds like Zeppelin on stage at the Royal Albert Hall, except they put Bill Ward's drums there and a couple different amps, and Black Sabbath came out and jammed this tune. To me, it really sounds like that. So. <laughs> um, drum insert, take one. All right, so here we go. This is it. Ooh. Sorry. With Bill Ward as opposed to Bonham, Ward's tendency is to slightly rush a little versus Bonham's slight tendency to sort of lay behind the beat a little. You have to take my word for it. Ward doesn't do it all the time, but in a lot of recordings, it just happens that way. But it's real music, man. They're in there. They're... This is a beefcake recording. And Mickey Hayes, this goes out to you and some other dudes that ask about Black Sabbath. I'll do my best with it. I want to get it really tight, but again, the time moves in this. There's little points where it picks up tempo. I'm, I'm trying to really match my playing to Bill Ward's time, okay? And it's especially, even if you listen to the studio recording with Ward playing along, you'll hear little points where Ward and Iomi get a little, what am I, Iomi. Richie Blackmore. I, I'm just going to shut up and play this. Here we go. All right, hang on. Now, this should be it. Yeah. Here we go.
So, God. Um, drum insert one. <laughs> so that's my sort of, it's like my third attempt at it. Um, because really you do in drum cover bill, especially with like jams like this, you kind of got to remember sort of little pickups. Well, of course the arrangement too. But this is real. This is really how it goes. Um, again, for Mickey Hayes, Mickey, I'll do a good one. I still have to do a good one of this and a good one of, uh, what's the one I did the other day that was kind of, well, like anything, it just takes a little work. Cause remember you're essentially trying to copy a piece of pre-existing art. Okay. So more videos on the way, please subscribe. If you haven't the George Flutus, Terry Keating, Bonzo, Bottom Led Zeppelin Drum Extravaganza channel is coming down the pipeline. We're going to sort that out soon. George had to run out of town as a professional drummer because he's a professional drummer. He has to make a living, go out on these coasts and do something. So, please have a good weekend. <laughs> Sorry. Please have a good weekend. More videos on the way, and thank you for subscribing.